I'm very proud of this vessel. We've got a great rig, we've got even better people. It's a new dawn for the Stenadon. The Stenadon has now finished its uh, project phase in Rotterdam and it's now in uh, Bergen to finish off the upgrades and uh, get ready to go back to work. This project has been about making an already capable rig even better by installing an eight-point mooring system. So with the additional weight of all the mooring equipment, we've had to compensate by installing additional buoyancy on the hull with two sponsons and four blisters. Integrated into the blisters are the chain lockers and the fair lead foundations and also the anchor winches which are mounted on the upper deck. The rig right now is a, can be drilling from 70 meter until 650 meter depth in uh, anchor with the anchor winch or with the DP system. That means that we can cover a big rank of uh, oil fields around the North Sea. We have uh, increased the POB for 120 to 140 people on board, and to this we had also increased the capacity of the lifeboat. This change is increased basically the the number of lifeboats from four to six, and we increase also the weight per person from 90 kilo to 98 kilo, as is required by the HSE. We are covered for working on uh, in the North Sea area between uh, UK and uh, Norway. We made the decision to change the British flag for the Stenadon. It's a flag of high quality. It now means that all our fleet are British registered. It's good for the clients, it's good for any operation we do worldwide. We have also increased the deck space. We have a two new deck extension on the port and starboard side. So we have an, an additional almost 300 square meter available for the deck cargo and uh, loading all the equipment that is necessary for a drilling campaign. Based on the previous campaign with Total and on the back of our excellent performance we've been awarded another contract with them which is hugely important to us. It's all about repeat business and doing a good job for our clients. I like the team on the Don because last year we, we, we could build a very relationship atmosphere and good atmosphere, friendly, it's always friendly here. And uh, I wanted to be back, so I'm back and it's a pleasure for me. With the mooring system upgrade, it will give you more opportunities uh, working somewhere else with the rig. It's a big thing for us. We've done over 20 completions with the Stenodon, so we're very averse to know what we're doing with that. Um, but in this case, we're running what we call uh, vertical trees. And to control all this equipment, we need a, an IWOX. This is basically a piece of equipment that we'll use to kind of control all the subsea equipment and the trees. And on here we're able to stack at least three trees at the same time, which is very good. The future for the Stenodon is very bright. We've opened ourselves up to a, a huge potential, not only in the UK but in worldwide operations, and allowing us to to be the best, to get out back out there and uh, do what we do well. It's a good crew and we are all positive and I'm sure that we will have a good standard like we have during the last project with Total. It would be good for the, uh, the people to go back to work, the equipment to go back to work and the Don to go back to work.